Good morning, everyone. Uh, welcome back to A Hat in Time. In the last part, well, we did a lot of... Well, actually, we did a very short part. I was going to say, we did a lot of failure in the Twilight Bell, but no. It's not quite how we did it. We, we only did the uh, quick um, rift, the lab rift. So, same area, it looks like, to the one we had the first time. Um, but the grounds are full of what look to be um, fans of us. Because, I mean, we were Max Diva last time. So, we're going to look around to see. It doesn't look like there's really anything too, too interesting. Alright, oh, that should have been, yeah, facing the right way. What do you have to say? Uh, DJ Grooves, hey, what's up? Hello, hello to you as well. I guess, I mean, the train one was pretty big because it's actually going through that entire wasteland oh, area. Stop recording the big parade. The movie that'll take the breath away from audiences worldwide. You'll be the star, as always. I have a question. Why do you have owls in yours? Owls are the other guy. To use our special way, darling. All right. You need to wear the parade outfit. Ah, which means we don't have dash. We do not have anything else. Only have the parade you hat. Parade, darling. And keep an eye out for good. The parade lasts a while. Nothing you can do to speed it up. <laughs> Nothing well, we can do to speed it up. Let's do this. Good luck, darling. Man, speedrunners must hate it automatically. But nothing we can do to speed it up. So, you see that line? That's the band. As long as we just kind of keep moving, they shouldn't be too much of a threat. Though, um, the electricity going down is doing something. Oh, and if you look, you can already see two DJ Groove tokens out there. They're, as we saw last time, pretty decent points. But we've, we've taken a little too much damage already. Oh, I was going to say, I hope we go fast and film. But you can see on the right side, there's something that's loading and charging. So... Oh, it's gonna hurt. And we can see there's some health over there, if we can make it there in time. But... It's time to turn the heat up! In it's time to turn the heat up! So we have to turn on the pyrotechnics. And you can see, we've already passed one of them. And he got rid of his stuff just because we took a little too long to get there. I, I think that's on. I can't actually tell. We died. Get ready. Go. And we start back at the very beginning again. But at least we know there's going to be some DJ group tokens over this way. Unless they're specifically designed to be far away. Because now if there's one way over... I don't know, that is pretty close to where I thought it was. Um, let's go over here and get this token. Which he just kind of threw down to the... It's death, because oh, you can't get that anymore. We're just gonna... yeah, we'll, we'll just circle with these guys. They move about... This, they're like the Shadow Mario from uh, Galaxy. They're gonna follow right behind you and duplicate your movements. So, if you walk really slow, I'll move really... oh. Unless they get bumped by each other. So, we just saw this, turning on the pyrotechnics, um, which means hit these things. You, give me your heart. Thank you. I thought the line that is behind me was one of those um, uh, 
What are they called? These things, the power lines. Oh, it wasn't, it was not letting me move. Interesting. Well, this is gonna hurt. Back up to the surface. Did I make it? I did not, and we're dead. It happens, it happens. We got two of them that time. Let's try to turn on the pyrotech next. Get ready. ready, go! Uh, this is a bad level for me to choose to switch to keyboard on. It's, well, I wasn't good at platforming before, and it's not helping that I don't know the controls as well. Though, I mean, fortunately, it's a very segment level. I can just show the completed attempt. Don't you dare throw his... Uh, the penguin is back into its death, because... This guy is a jerk and just decides that DJ Group Token. Okay, I don't understand the death. Thanks, game. Fortunately, I can just cut out the um, attempts that are failures. That is one good thing about this. Oh, come on. Well, we almost got to the pyrotechnics that time. Get ready, Get ready and go! Uh, I'm glad I didn't do this the first time, like while I was just uh, doing this during my first time into this area. Cause, well, it's a bit sad because you didn't need anything special for this one. Um, it's still a little easier than. Come on, give me the DJ groove sign. Finally, we've successfully got one of those. Sorry if I get a bit quiet, I am. This is uh, attempt four or five already, so. It is me just trying to not die. Because these guys are much bigger annoyances than I thought they were going to be. Oh, that is a uh, shift. I want to be hitting control. So, at this point, we have to turn on the pyrotechnics, which is just hit these three. I'd like to call them egg timers. Uh, while not getting hit is the uh, key part of this. If I come across any hearts on our way, that's definitely what I want to do, but the parade doesn't uh, speed up until after uh, we have gotten that done. Don't you dare. Well, I guess we're, I guess we're going through the uh, low area. Oh, this is gonna hurt. That hurt less than expected, honestly speaking. Lots of cutting's gonna be needed on this one. Well, I guess, yeah. Why not? Do, 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 do. Oh, we got a DJ Grooves popping behind us. Oh, that's actually one that we might be able to get. We'll head there first. So they're gonna be giving these two coupons and these uh, tokens. Well, we've seen them before in the first set of those levels. There was both the conductors and the DJ groups, depending on the level. Sweet! I will take the two of them right there. I guess the game really wants uh, DJ groups. Uh, sorry, yeah, DJ groups to win here because, well, he wouldn't be giving me so many points for him otherwise. Oh come on! I'm gonna say, did you really just lock me onto a spot I can't get? Alright, we gotta turn on the pyrotechnics now, which is hit these three egg timer thingies. Uh, I think we should go for this guy over here first. He is closest anyways. Uh, so we just go... Oh, 
and try to make sure we still have a decent amount of space for that because you do have to stop to actually hit the egg timer so you gotta be careful there oops and if you miss you will hit the ground take some damage and hopefully be able to land on another platform while you're doing it uh, if you get really unlucky you can get trapped with the band though because the band will hurt you too Flew into a corner, band was immediately behind me, couldn't do anything, I'm so sad there. Get ready and go! Alright, um, the, the last one went pretty well. Uh, that one went terribly. Like literally, got hit, flew, landed into the crowd, and then Get landed ready. on the electricity. Um, Alright, round... Seven, maybe? I guess. I don't know if I should count that last one because uh, we got hit by the crowd, launched into the band, and then got hit by electricity all in a few seconds' time. I'm like, come on, that was literally when the um, invincibility ended. However, if it's counting my uh, DJ Groove tickets, like, uh, sorry, um, tokens, medals, whatever they're called, um, from each attempt. He's going to have so many points, and I'm not sure how the conductor will have any chance of beating him. That's, uh, well, we can try to go. I'm getting a little better big, better hang on the controls on this uh, keyboard. So, uh, at least that's something that's good that's happening right now. We can go get ourselves another heart pawn. And we're waiting for this blue circle to fill up. It's time! To turn, to turn up the heat on the movie. Can you turn on the, pyrotechnic? You turn on the pyrotechnic? Yes, we can. It's turn on these three egg timer things, including the one we're standing right next to already. So we will hit it and continue on. I don't want to rely too much on my um, dash jump thing because it flies me unpredictable directions at times. Oh, we hit a wing. Interesting. Come on, there we are. I do enjoy that you get another jump at the end of your dash. Oh, come on. Well, we're trapped under that, so we're taking another hit. However, we finally turned down those three things. Three, two, one, go. That entire area there is now probably very uh, deadly to stand on. So we're just not going to do that. And we're waiting for it to fill up again. Looks like we have a little bit to go. Um, oh, oh, oh. There, we, we fell again. Uh, looks like we've got a bit to go before it charges up and we have to do our next task. Not sure what that's going to be. We haven't reached it yet. A lot of the rooftops are now blocked with uh, fire from the pyrotechnics. Any of the flat rooftops. Oh, come on, game. You know I need that heart. Don't you just go hiding it on me? I was stuck on the wall. Though where I landed should have been fine. I don't look looks like I could have taken any damage there. Alright. Oh! Because we actually completed a part of it last time, um, that's one less we have to worry about now. So we are officially, we've turned on the pyrotechnics. Which theoretically means those uh, groups, ones that we have collected in the round we just did, should still be active. I say should because I don't actually know. However, we can see it's counting down, which means this plan is the boat to ignite. Which is uh, troublesome, really. Oh, come on. Don't you kill me like this again, game. 
Uh, I guess you would have seen that last one now. Um, caught us at the last possible second and then launched us to where we needed, like where we couldn't get out. There. All right. So as long as the pyrotechnics aren't on on a building, it should be fairly safe to take. I don't like, however, that uh, the band will hit you and then you will be forced to land um, this movie needs more action. Darling, turn, turn on fireworks. Alright, so we're looking for those power buttons we've been seeing uh, the last few times. I'm going to say, I'm like, what's it going to do? Because I was um, not in exactly the best spot for where we just were. Oh, that is DJ Grooves' spot. Alright. Well, we can travel across this firework, at least, to hit this power button. Um, but we have, it looks like, three or four of these ones to turn on. Um, which may be a little, a little more troublesome than... Uh, oh! Oh, the firework cannons literally are shooting fireworks at us. Alright. I guess I kind of should have expected that from the term fireworks cannon, but um, I didn't realize, yeah, they were another thing trying to kill us, like everything else on this map. Um, oh, I guess it was only the three of them. I don't like how I got here in time, but no. Uh, he no longer has his heart pawn for me. He destroyed it. Thankfully, we have taken out the fireworks cannons. We have turned on the pyrotechnics, so we really are just doing a waiting game until DJ Grooves decides it's the right time for the ball drop. So we're going to stay on this roof because... Grab it, Doc. And I don't believe that the band stops. So... Yeah, they do not. We want to get that as soon as possible. Actually, all things considered, including all the failures, that was only about 18 minutes. Uh, I will probably cut a few of them out because some of them were me frustrated because I got hit immediately and then wiped out pretty quick. But DJ Grooves was the stylish mentor. Little girl as parade marshal. Moon Pebbles as the. And it only counts the one. Uh, at this point, I think it's actually impossible for um, the DJ groups to win unless I go and do another one of his levels to try to get as many points as possible. But it's not the end of the world. Um, the conductor can win. It's no big deal. Uh, the end of that one, much like the train scene, doesn't truly matter too much. But thank you guys for watching this episode of A Hat in Time. In the next part, let's go do the conductor's side. See you guys then.